magical Christmas as the Harry Potter movie franchise celebrates its 20th anniversary with a very special reunion show. I have to say, I Look wish we just, face. I wish <laughs> we just had, had a shot on you watching that trailer <laughs> um, because the excitement was second to none. Uh, well, we are joined now by Victoria McLean, who claims to, I don't think you need to claim because I think I've witnessed it myself, uh, to be one of the world's biggest Harry Potter fans. And she's bought some. And you've just told me this is 30, about 30%. About 30%-ish, of your yeah. I you, huge you would fill collection. the entire room. I mean, well, we, we love having it here this morning. So <laughs> thanks for uh, bringing that all down. Now, you are a huge, huge Harry Potter fan. Yeah. You know, Self-proclaimed super yeah. fan. When did your love of Harry Potter begin? It was in 2001. I heard that the film was coming out. And there was... I'm not one for following trends, believe it or not, I know. Um, <laughs> but, uh, but oh, I you're thought, back on trend in that. Well, I, I tried. Yeah. <laughs> but I, I, I saw on Blue Peter and it was on there and J.K. Rowling was being interviewed and I thought, do you know what? I was pregnant with my son. I couldn't leave my bed because the pregnancy was a bit difficult. I got the book and I read it. And after the, reading the first book, The Philosopher's Stone, uh, Smarties edition, that was it. I, it was my magic had come to life. But that came out in 97. And yeah. you watched the first film, 2001? That's right, so Why yes. was there a gap? Were you not interested in it the was book? The, people were talking about it and I'm like, no, I don't... And I was dyslexic. I'm autistic as well, so dyslexia for me was, you know, reading a book was a really hard task. Yeah. yeah. But I, just, I was determined I couldn't do anything. You know, there was no kind of, you know, Facebook and stuff back then. Uh -huh. So I, uh, yeah, I read it and that was it. I was... And did I you was start hooked. collecting straight away? No, or did it I take, didn't. Was, it, was there something that ignited your passion for Harry mm. Potter? I think it's because I started getting little bits here and there. There was... Excuse me, there was things that came out in early 2000, 2001, but they were based on the books rather than the right, films. OK. And so I kind of picked up little bits here and there, you know, but they didn't look like Daniel Radcliffe, Emma Watson, Rupert Grint and so on. And so I, I saw... I got this book and it explained this beautiful snow globe called the San Francisco... from the San Francisco Music Company. And it was Harry pushing his trolley through the platform nine and three quarters. Yes. And the, uh, the Hogwarts Express going around the bottom playing the music. And I was determined to find it. And when I found it and it arrived at home, I think that was kind of the trigger. And then I lost my mum seven years ago and she was a big Harry Potter fan. And so when I was kind of collecting, it was also a little kind of nod to her yes. as well. Yeah. That's one of my excuses. Sorry, mum. But I really, <laughs> I needed an excuse. But I, I, yeah, I mean, look at these beautiful items that these companies produce. I can't go to Hogwarts. So I brought Hogwarts to me. Um, well, you've brought it to us today. <laughs> yeah, thankful. you really have. Why, You're welcome. <laughs> can, I, can I ask why? I mean, uh, I've seen some of the Harry Potter films. Uh, I apologise. I haven't now, seen then? a whole film from start to finish. I, I'm, I, di I'm, I dip I'm in. I'm with you. I dip I'm in. So I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry. Why are there <laughs> so many ones? Well, they started bringing out, obviously, a couple of the original ones. Noble Collection started releasing them. Um, and then the more the films became kind of a big draw for fans, the more people wanted to buy and then the more characters were released. So not all of these ones were released in the beginning. So of course you've got the two main, watch. two of yes. the three main characters that you have, you can, you know, pull them out and give them away. I'm scared, I'm scared to touch I'm, just, I'm just a bit frightened because <laughs> I know go. how special yeah, this is. Nice. Yeah, look. So, that's oh, Hermione's. Nice. Hermione Grange is this one. That's it, and that's Harry's. Nice. <laughs> hey, you never know. You can have a one never know, later. Babe. You never know. <laughs> you never know. Now, so listen, is this, is this, be is this become pretty much a full-time job for you? It has. I mean, I've got a YouTube channel under my own name, Victoria McLean, and I'm on social media oh, as well. Again. Oh, my go God, on. yeah, Victoria McLean, come on. Subscribe to me, come yeah, on. Yeah, get in there. <laughs> like, comment below. But this is stuff. it. Yeah. But I, I, I get to share my passion. I mean, how many people do you know who have a passion that I feel for Harry Potter that actually gets to... Yeah. I mean, he gets paid to do that as a job. Absolutely. You know, so I get to share this a magic community with everybody. And for me, people say, why is it so popular still 20 years on? It's the community, I think, because right. we are such a wonderful family of And the films followers. are great. And you well, can watch them whenever. This is exactly true. And the books are better because right. there's far more in them. Mm -hmm. But the films are amazing. I mean, that reunion that's coming up, there's not a, a, a tweet or a, an Instagram post that isn't about that. Well, I, I, I want to ask you, because I know that you... Like, this is obviously a real passion of yours and it's, and it's made its way throughout your whole life, not just the fact that you collect memorabilia. And I know that your husband is a big Star Wars fan. <laughs> yeah. You are a huge Harry Potter fan and your wedding was actually based on the films. It was. So <laughs> I, I, I'm just so curious, how does one put 
on a Star Wars Harry Potter themed wedding. How does that look? Yeah, because I want to know how can those two worlds collide? Yeah. Oh, they Is can, Vernon. They can, Arisha, really? They are amazing. Um, well, I had a, a year. I had a. Oh. That was the sword of Gryffindor borrowed, I have to say. I did let him have the cake. <laughs> he had the cake. I let him have the cake. It's right. a Star Wars Is that a Death Star cake? cake? No, it's when... Oh, my gosh, I'm going to get shouted at. That's when they're in the ice oh, planet. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and, yeah, and, and he, that's it. And that was from Hobbycraft, that castle, the Hogwarts castle. They made it, and I was allowed to borrow it for the wedding. Oh, my gosh. So that was amazing. But I had a whole year... I had a budget of £7,000. I had a whole year, and I made almost everything. Oh, well except done. the cake. And Fabulous. obviously the dress. Yeah. But uh, but yeah, Star Wars and Harry Potter actually worked really well. I wanted to kind of he means the world to me. He is my song mate. And so Aww. I wanted to give him, you know, half of, of the love. So I gave him Star Wars and I had the Harry Potter. But it was our anniversary yesterday of eight years, and I still feel like I'm in the honeymoon period. Oh, oh congratulations. We we're very, very happy. And but... Did your guest turn up at the reception in fancy dress or was it normal? <laughs> no, we did tell his mother that she what? had to wear Princess Leia costume though. Just I... just to be on the horrible side. <laughs> but no, she didn't. <laughs> <laughs> well, I love this, and yeah, your, I mean, your passion is working for you. That is, yeah, that for is you. for sure. Absolutely love it. Yeah, and you can catch the reunion show on New Year's Day on Sky. Yes. Lovely. He's, <laughs> he's already looking. <laughs> 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 Thank God, <I'm> not late. <laughs> Ready well, to go. You Ready to go. Enjoy that. You enjoy <laughs> it. Thank, Thank you very much for Thank coming. You. <laughs>